Hello everyone. In this video, we have this nice exponential equation. We have 4 to the power 2x minus 1 over x minus 1 plus 4 to the power 3x minus 2 all over x minus 1. And this whole thing is equal to 320. And we have to find the value of x. But before we begin, if you are new here, please consider subscribed and also don't forget to like this video. Thanks a lot for subscribing. Now let's get started. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to break this equation down. So we have 4 to the power 2x minus 1 all over x minus 1, then plus 4 to the power. Now this 3x minus 2 could also be written as x minus 1, then plus 2x minus 1. And this whole thing is divided by x minus 1. And this is equal to 320. Okay, so from here, I'll just keep this one. So we have 4 to the power 2x minus 1 over x minus 1, then plus 4 to the power. Now I will split this fraction. So we have x minus 1 over x minus 1, then plus 2x minus 1 over x minus 1. And this is equal to 320. Okay, so I will still maintain this one. So we have 4 to the power 2x minus 1 over x minus 1 plus 4 to the power. Now the whole of this thing will cancel this. Now we have 1 plus 2x minus 1 over x minus 1. And this is equal to 320. Okay, so from here we have... 4 to the power 2x minus 1 over x minus 1, then plus, and this whole thing is also the same as 4 to the power 1 times 4 to the power 2x minus 1 over x minus 1, and this is equal to 320. We have 4 to the power 2x minus 1 over x minus 1 over here, and the same thing is over here as well so I can factor it out so we have 4 to the power 2x minus 1 over x minus 1 into 1 plus 4 and this is equal to 320 all right so we have 4 to the power 2x minus 1 over x minus 1 times 5 is equal to now, this 320 could also be written as 4 to the power 3 times 5, okay? So, from here, let's go ahead and then divide each side of the equation by 5, okay? So, that this one will cancel this, and then this one will cancel this as well. So, we have 4 to the power 2x minus 1 over x minus 1 is equal to 4 to the power 3, Okay, now you can see that we have the same basis, so we can equate the exponents. So we have 2 times x minus 1 over x minus 1 is equal to 3. Now let's go ahead and then cross multiply. So we have 2x minus 1 is equal to 3 into x minus 1. Okay, simplifying this, we have 2x minus 1 is equal to 3x minus 3. Now let's move the terms with the variable to the right hand side. So we have negative 1 plus 3 is equal to 3x minus 2x. Okay, now negative 1 plus 3 is nothing but 2 and this is equal to x. Okay, so this implies that x is equal to 2. So this is our answer. Now let's go ahead and then substitute the value of x into the equation to see whether it satisfies the equation. Okay, so here we have 4 to the power 2x minus 1 over x minus 1. Then we have 4 to the power 3x minus 2 over x minus 1. All right. And this should be equal to 320. All right. And we know x to be 2. So we have 4 to the power 2 times 2 minus 1 over 2 minus 1, then plus 4 to the power 3 times 2 minus 2 over 2 minus 1. 
and this should be equal to 320. Now we know that 2 times 2 is 4 minus 1 is 3. So we have 4 to the power 3 then plus 3 times 2 is 6 minus 2 is 4. So we have 4 to the power 4. Okay, and this should be equal to 320. 4 to the power 3 is nothing but 64 then plus 4 to the power 4 is 256 and this should be equal to 320. Now 64 plus 256 is equal to 320 and this is also equal to 320. Since the left hand side is equal to the right hand side, we can conclude that x equals 2 is a solution to the problem. So guys, I hope you found this video useful. Please give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thanks a lot for watching. See you again on the next video.